welcome two of the best teams in the game square off. It's the Los Angeles Dodgers going up against the Atlanta Braves. And we'll be back with the first pitch right after this. One down. Freddie Freeman up to the dish. He was hitless at four at bats on Sunday. Freeman. Here's a 2 2. Swing and a pop up. Oh, you, you got it. And Freeman is retired. And there's two down. Good hard fastball up in the zone right there. They look really the right good coming hitter. in, but so hard to get on top of as a hitter. Back here in Atlanta, here's yeah. Shohei Otani. Great hitter. speed and Shohei. great power. A great Otani. athlete, quite simply. Hey, get him Anderson right here, back kid. to work. Up the middle, Tejada. Throws to first. One up, one down. Batting six. The left fielder, number 25. Trace. And welcome back. Stepping in, the slugging shortstop, King Tejada. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports, too. And here it comes. Swing and a miss. Saying he wasn't very sharp in the first, got hit around a little bit, just wasn't able to locate particularly well. A lot of stuff for the fat part of the plate. Yeah, Boog, he wasn't fooling anyone. It's a tough place to be because it's not always obvious what adjustments need to be made. Sometimes it's location. Sometimes it's being too predictable. Sometimes you're tipping your pitches. He's going to need to figure it out quickly, though. And the 0-2. That one is absolutely belted. Taylor going back on this one. Looking up. Grabs it right up against the wall. Shohei Otani up to the dish. 0 for 1. He grounded out in his first at bat. Bounced up the middle. Tejada. On the run. Sends it over to first. Third out. And the Dodgers leave them loaded. They trail in this one, 3 0. Here's a big power no threat. Number King two. Tejada. Short Hit stop. it well, but flied out King. to the deepest part Short of the outfield his first time. This kid is so special. He's a shortstop by hey, trade and big it. time oh, power. Stop. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Seems like from day one, his strike zone and plate discipline looked like he'd been in the league for six years already. Hammered. Base hit. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. And that keeps his hitting streak going. He's making this look way easier than it is, Boog. Setting the record is hard enough, but to keep upping it every day like he is, I don't really know what to say anymore. At this point, it honestly feels like it's never going to end. Absolutely remarkable. Here's Sean Murphy. Grounded out his first time. The 1-1. Just missed. Hey, nice eye out there. Olsen, the lead runner at second. Tejada on at first with two now. I see it drive it. Let's go, big dog. Ball. Next pitch misses, and that's ball three. A rare three ball count here. He's been throwing strikes all day. Got to be ready to hit if you're in the box. Hey, see it. Drive it. And that'll oh. load the bases. Thanks, well, interesting. He went with the off speed and walked the hitter. No Man, you got to challenge the guy with the fastball. Here's Jesse Winker. One for one so far today with a solo homer in his first at bat. Well, it stinks to be down by, you know, these runs early in this ball game like this. But you've got two outs. You've got to close the door because you still have a chance with how much time is left in this one. 
Here's a 1 1. And that's a strike. Big moment in this game. Two outs, two runners in scoring position, and could really break this thing wide open early. One and two now. To the right side. And that one finds its way through. One runs in, in there safely. And the lead is up to five. His confidence level is so high. Really nice job of coming through in a big spot. Hooked around that pitch on the outside, but he was still able to square it up pretty nicely. And that takes quick, strong wrist to pull that off. So first and second with two outs. Gavin Lux now at the plate. Swing and a ground ball out to short. They get the force. That ends the frame. Two men left stranded, but they do push across one. We're midway in the fourth. It's the Braves five and the Dodgers one. Here's Mookie Betts. Right fielder, Mookie Betts. On the ground, two ball. Flips to second. On to Olsen. That's two. Really nice double play turn right there. And it all started with that sweet glove flip on the feed to second. You know, these middle infielders, they spend a lot of time honing that glove work, so it just becomes like second nature. I think you also have to have a really good glove that's broken in that's not too large so that you can have a feel for that baseball and be able to flip it like you're barehanded. Shortstop. Welcome back. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Now it's going to be King Tejada. The pitch. Swing and a miss, strike one. You know, these Braves putting together some really good at-bats in this game. There's been a lot to like with how they're approaching their chances at the plate. It looked to me like they really wanted to get to the starter early, get him out of the game before he settles in. So I'd say mission accomplished. The next pitch misses. Now one and two. Come on, baby, get your pitch up there. That one drilled left field. And it hits the fence. Into second with a double. And they've got something brewing now. Well, Singy, he is locked in there. Well, he's really slowed the game down. And it's like he's moving in full speed and everybody is a step or two behind. The way that he squared up that baseball tells me that he is seeing it like a beach ball. Here's Murphy now. He's 0 for 1. The lefty ready and a 1 1. And a foul ball. Let's go, kid. Here we go. Next That's offering ball, misses. Ball two. Bullpen activity starting up now. Yenzi Almonte up and loosening in the pen. And now the lefty runner takes off for third. There's a ball. Throw, and they got him. Here's Joey Wendell. One for three. Joey. On the ground to short. Tejada. Zips it to first. And there are two outs. They've got a potent lineup. And now when you think about teams capable of rallying yeah, from this kind of deficit, look. they're right at the top of the list. Up Man in scoring position with two away. Sure King so. Tejada next up for the Braves. Hey, Drove it off the wall last time. Right, just right missed right out right on now. a home run. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. Everyone can have a little chuckle there. He's had such a great season. Rarely ever do you see that kind of swing. He swings and fouls one off. Olsen stands at second with two gone. Hey, let her rip, let her rip. Fights it off, he'll see another.
And a swing and a miss. And that's that. Two on with one out. Trace Thompson steps to the plate for the Dodgers. One for two. And a one-two. Ground ball left side could be two. Quick feed to second for one. Double play. They can't seem to break through. Inning over. So they're able to work around a pair of walks in the inning. Home half of inning number eight straight ahead. It's the Braves five and the Dodgers one. And now it's going to be Miguel Vargas. Runners on the corners, no outs. Hey, no outs now. Ground ball could be two. And that one handled. Fired to second. They get the out, but the run scores on the twin killing. First and third, nobody out. You're thinking you've got it lined up for a pretty big inning right here. So that double play is pretty deflating. They get the run in, but now they're starting all over. Well, this is definitely a rarity, a one-pitch save. You come into the ball game, so much pressure, don't know what's going to happen, and fortunately, you make the pitch, you get the out, and everyone has a big sigh of relief. And your final score, 5-2. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon.